The Xbox app, which is also called the Xbox Game Pass for PC, is Microsoft's answer to Steam. So far, it has worked well most of the time. But just like Steam and other platforms for getting video games, the Xbox app has its own problems. Many users say that the Xbox app sometimes won't open or launch. In this video, we'll show you what you can try if your Xbox Game Pass app won't open. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. First, wait for the Xbox app. The Xbox app may take a few minutes to start up and open the first time. This usually happens after a system update or after reinstalling the app. System updates sometimes get rid of the old cache, so it might take a little longer for your apps to open afterward. If you just installed a Windows OS update, give the Xbox app a few minutes to rebuild its cache so that it will open faster the next time. Next, clear the cache of Microsoft Store app. The Xbox app is linked to the Microsoft Store app, and problems with the Microsoft Store app can sometimes affect the Xbox app as well. Clearing the app's cache is one thing you can do to fix the Microsoft Store app. Here's what you need to do. Press the Windows key on your keyboard or press the Start button on the taskbar. Type in WS Reset and select WS Reset Run command. Confirm the reset. Next, reset the Microsoft Store. You can also try resetting the Microsoft Store app, which is another possible fix. This is what you need to do if clearing the cache didn't help at all. You can reset the Microsoft Store app to make sure it works right. Press the Windows key on your keyboard or press the Start button on the taskbar. Select the Settings icon. Select Apps. Select Apps and Features. Find Microsoft Store from the list and click on Advanced Options. Click on Terminate. Check for the problem. Next, verify the Xbox server status. If the Xbox app still won't open, the next best thing to do is to see how the Xbox servers are doing. Just like game servers, the Xbox servers can sometimes go down without warning because of an outage or because they need to be fixed. Visit the Xbox website to find out how the servers are doing. Next. Check your Microsoft account. If you can't use the Xbox app because you can't sign in, you may have a problem with your Microsoft account. Check to see if you're using the right account to log in. If you have more than one Microsoft account signed in on your PC, you need to do this. Next, check your subscription. It's also a good idea to see if your subscription has run out. This could be the case if the launcher is not accepting any games. Next, double check your computer's date and time. If you're still having trouble with Xbox Game Pass, double check that your computer's clock is set correctly. To explain how, press the Windows key on your keyboard or click on the Start button on the taskbar. Type in date and time and select Change the date and time. In the date and time menu, make sure to enable set time automatically and set time zone automatically. Next, check for software update. The final thing you can do is make sure Windows is up to date. If you want to check for updates, you can do so by pressing the Windows key on your keyboard or clicking the Start button in the taskbar, typing Update, and then clicking the Check for Updates button. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends, this can greatly help in making Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.